What's going on guys? We got a Kawasaki Mule 4010 in the shop today and the customer was having some problems with it not staying charged and everything and we're just going to go over a couple quick tips on things you can check to see what's going on with your system. So first thing obviously you're going to want to check is your battery. So get you a multimeter like this or similar to this. Come in here. You're going to want to put your hot to your hot, your ground on there. And as you can see, we're reading 12.5. That's how many volts our battery has with the machine not running. So now what we're wanting to do is check our charging system and our voltage regulator. So how to do that is we're going to crank our machine. Now that we got our machine running, we're going to go back and put our tester back on our battery. And with it on there and the machine running, we've got 13.8, 13.9. So the reading we're getting with our voltage meter and everything shows that everything is good. Anything from 12.5 to 14.5 are good readings. Anything over 14.5 is a system overcharge and can damage your battery. Anything below a 12.5, the system is not gonna be charging your battery enough. This customer's problem was his voltage regulator. We replaced it with the used one we had here at the shop. Now in replacing this, and it did not fix the issues, you're gonna to wanna to move on to your stators. But most of the time in replacing your voltage regulator fixes an issue like this. And of course his battery was weak and we put him a brand new battery on it. If y'all find videos like this helpful, don't forget to give us a follow. Go check out our YouTube video. We have a complete list of parts, tools, and everything you'll need to complete jobs like this in our description. Thanks for watching.